Frauen. Dapat pala pinin mo din. Oh no. Ha? Sana ko yung plita.
direction of the very talented Mrs. May. That we are celebrating today. Their graduation is the culmination of 13 years of hard work. It is also a reminder of the support from your parents, peers, teachers, and staff over the years to help guide and influence you. As you enter the next phase of your journey, you will continue to face numerous choices. Some of these choices will be seen as significant, such as your career or relationships. But I would suggest that the most significant choices that you will make will occur on a daily basis, choices that will define you as a person. I encourage you to make the choice to be kind to people, the choice to be optimistic, the choice to work hard, the choice to be hopeful, and the choice to help others. The choices that you cultivate reflect who you choose to be. Believe in yourself and your community so you can achieve the right future that I'm confident will raise you. Congratulations, graduating class of 2023. At Vincent Assey, we also have what is called the Student Recognition Program, in which certificates and medallions are awarded to students in recognition of their achievements in school citizenship, performing arts, athletics, and academics. Achievement in any one category earns the student a certificate, while an achievement in two categories earns a bronze medal. Achievement in three categories earns a silver medal. And achievement in all four categories earns a gold medal. We would also like to welcome the presenters of sponsored scholarships and awards from our school, our school division, and our community businesses and organizations. We appreciate your contributions in recognizing our graduates. Presenting diplomas and awards today will be Principal Bryce Ridgen, Vice Principal Kurt Hunter, Vice Principal Ashley Dyson and Mrs. Stacy Bradley. Atheo will study fine arts and architecture at Brandon University and University of Manitoba. Her favorite part of high school was being a part of the basketball, badminton, and soccer teams. Althea would like to thank her parents and her friends for their unconditional love and support. She is a member of the Honor Roll, which received a gold medal for recognition in all four categories, and is the Varsity Rabbit MVP. Katie Gould. In the future, sponsored by BDO. This year's recipient of the, recipient of the Governor General's Bronze Medal earned a final mark of 100% in six credits. With deep academic understanding and exceptional capability, this student is also respected by teachers for patience and persistence. Motivated by self-interest and curiosity, after writing two AP exams in May, he continued to work in the science lab on extra experiments and projects. He will continue in scientific development and construction in a mechanical engineering program. In AP physics, the student is known as Ice. On behalf of Her Ex Excellency, the Right Honorable Mary Simon, the Governor General of Canada, please join me in congratulating this year's Governor General Bronze Medal winner, Matthew Fugelberg.
class, texting your friends, playing video games, everyone had those for you. We pretty much did everything we could to keep our social lives intact. Grade 10. It was a fever dream. Classes were split A to K and L to Z. You spend one day in bed staring at Microsoft Teams, and the next, you're in a class that felt way too empty. Not only that, but you could also only see the top half of everyone's faces. Maybe we were all just tired from the isolation, or maybe it was the fact that we only spent half of our time in school, and we lacked those exciting events for grade 9, but sophomore year flew by in the blink of an eye. Grade 11, things were finally settling down. Restrictions were easing up, and many extracurriculars were on the rise again. Shout out to the varsity football team for winning the championship. You guys couldn't have done it without me. Keep it the bench nice and warm. In all seriousness, though, I believe junior year was packed with growth. We started venturing off into classes and clubs that piqued our individual interests. Maybe you wanted to challenge yourself with AP courses, or you just wanted to get as many classes as possible out of the way to have a stress for your senior year. Maybe sports weren't your niche, but you had astonishing confidence singing your heart out on stage in the major production of Charlie Brown. Maybe you were too nervous to speak in front of the school as the student council representative, but could collapse your opponent's argument in the big club. I know there are still a plethora of clubs that I haven't mentioned, but the point I'm trying to make is that in our junior year, we realized what we wanted, and that's what we had. Now finally, senior year. Wow, it has flown by. So many memories and so little time to talk. Please stand. Move the tassel from the right side of your cap to the left. On behalf of Vincent Massey High School, the Brandon School Division, and the province of Manitoba, I proudly present to you the 2023 graduating class of Vincent Massey High School. Thank you. 